Tilsey. I'm with Andy Townsend here. It's a match to decide who goes through to the World Cup semi-finals. Lots at stake, lots of pressure. Let's hope we get a great game. Rio is experiencing a bit of a heat wave. Sweltering sunshine at the Maracanã. Test of fitness, this. Oh, the weather's perfect. It's absolutely glorious. All ready to go here, but not until we've heard the national anthems of Bosnia and Herzegovina and Germany. of this World Cup were probably the minimum requirement for both of these two nations. No more than was expected of them, really, but this quarter-final will be the end of the line for one of them. This is knockout football now. It certainly is, Clive. It could be a long old game, this one. It can go the distance, so don't have to try and win it in the first five or ten minutes. You've got to pace yourself today. Yugoslavia have been World Cup candidates in the past. The, uh, the nations that have now grown out of the old Yugoslavia, full of talented players like Bosnia Herzegovina. They do have some special players, they really do. It's just whether they've got enough all round to have a serious impact. We'll see. Miroslav closer. Germany on the attack. What can they come up with here? What can he do here? Goal! Keeper got to it, couldn't turn it away. control of the quarter-final the opening goal can be so important it's going to be so difficult to pick Germany back from here delivers it in rather anxious clearance opened up for him here they've got it may be all but over already you may see a bit more here Andy look at the replay they're through Germany are World Cup semi-finalists again the dream is alive and it may just be a little bit more than a dream now they've got that look like the look of a German team that's destined to win this tournament